class, Professor Akamon here with the Psychology Short. Today's homework is reading up to Chapter 14 of Fate Grand Order's fourth law spell, Yuga Shetra. When the team finally decides to allow Tamamovich onto the shadow border, Gordolf says this. The only thing I'm hopeful for at the moment is the suspension bridge effect. But what exactly is the suspension bridge effect? Well, you can probably guess from context that it's something to do with getting up close and personal with Tamamo, and you'd be right. But let's go into a little psychology. The suspension bridge effect is more commonly referred to as misattribution of arousal. Now, arousal in psychology doesn't necessarily mean sexy stuff. It can just kind of means you're more alert than you would be otherwise. You're awake, you're in the moment. We usually use this term to describe emotions. Low arousal emotions are ones that aren't super intense, like boredom, melancholy, or contentment. High arousal emotions are more like excitement, anger, or fear. Misattribution of arousal, aka what Gordolf's calling the suspension bridge effect, happens when you get all worked up about one thing, high arousal, but you think it's something else. We usually talk about this in terms of experiencing some kind of high arousal emotion like fear, but misattributing that high arousal to some other emotion like attraction. A pretty famous example of this is the suspension bridge study done by Dutton and Aaron in 1974. They took a bunch of guys and had them either walk across a really scary rickety suspension bridge or a super sturdy bridge. At the end, a woman involved in the study gave them a survey and told them to call her if they had any questions. The men who walked across the scary bridge were more likely than the men who walked across the sturdy bridge to call the woman later down the line. Dutton and Aaron interpreted this in that, as them finding her more attractive. In other words, they mistakenly attributed the increased heart rate from crossing the scary bridge to attraction to the woman. In this case, because Tamamo just got beaten the heck up and is in a life or death situation, she's the guy who just crossed the bridge and Gordol's hoping that he's the lady at the end of it. This affects why some people will recommend roller coasters or horror movies for dates, but it isn't just fear. Schachter and Singer found that giving people medication makes, that makes their heart race, or caffeine, has pretty similar effects and can make people think they're experiencing all kinds of emotions like anger or euphoria. TLDR, Portal's hoping Tamamovich's recent brush with death will help him get her number. That's all for now. See you next class.